You really can do very, very strange things with matter. The trick is to change the scale at which the effect is operating. This is a material you have seen before. Here's a piece of iron, and I'm going to put it in a very hot furnace. Now, this is like a Bunsen burner, this. And it's, it's just a giant one, actually. And this is an air mover. And what this is going to do here is when that Bunsen burner is on, if I put anything under here, it'll zoom it into the flame. Do you want to light that, Andy? Yeah. Oh, fantastic. OK. So that's a Bunsen burner, and I've got a means of putting stuff into it. Now, with this piece of iron, all I, all I need to do is just put it in the flame, and we'll see what happens. Let's turn it up to full power. Nothing happens, right? I could, I could have put that in there for half an hour. The only thing that would have happened is get red hot. Now, I take the same material, I make it into a powder form. So I've got here just a powdered iron. The only difference is the scale in which it exists. And now I'm going to put this into the flame. Let's see what that does. OK. I think you all agree that's a very different effect. <laughs> So how can this be? How can we just change the scale of this material from a bar to a tiny powder and get what looks like fireworks? <laughs>